<laughs> you wanna you wanna redo? Just say just say something again. Say welcome to the Shaggy Show again. Just redo that. Why? Just don't worry about it. Just you fucking it. missed all of that. No, 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 no. It was on. They saw it. Oh, they the just, audio was they just off. didn't hear it. Oh, you're such an asshole. I made myself <laughs> sick for nothing. <laughs> It's the fucking Shaggy Show. <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. Let's get it started hot and ready like a Little Caesars pizza. What do you say? Hell yeah, hell yeah. R.I.P. <gasps> yes, Justin has will know, not know who this motherfucker is. Probably not. not a, no, well, there's absolutely no chance you'll know who this is. Richard Roundtree has passed on to the nether void. And where did I know him from? Shaft. Oh, you want to hear an interesting story? Of course. It's very interesting. This is from the 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 uh, Samuel Jackson Jackson Shaft. In that movie, have you ever noticed his jiggy facial hair configuration? It, go, go ahead and Google yeah. Samuel L. Jackson Shaft. I want you to look at his his facial hair on this. Samuel Jackson's not not with an S. <laughs> we don't want to see his shaft. There it is, right in the middle. Bam. So uh. The the DVD must have first came out or whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying? Because I remember watching it on the road, and I, I told everybody on, on the bus, I was like, everybody's going to wake up tomorrow, my fucking facial hair is going to look just like shafts, and I'm going to get mad bitches. <laughs> <laughs> so, sure enough, everybody woke up that morning, and I shaved my shit to look exactly like his facial hair, and I got mad bitches that night. More than normal. More than Because normal. my facial hair was in that configuration. True story. Everybody was like, God damn, I, got, I kept it until it grew out. But once it grew out, no more bitches. No more. None. <laughs> nope, it was the fucking shaft beard that did it. <laughs> but yeah, it, it fucking worked somehow. It was a bitch trap. It was like yeah. a bitch net. It was. <laughs> Real shit. I'm not lying. I believe you. I don't think you do. Justin thinks I'm full of shit. Justin thinks you I have... No input on this. <laughs> he was like, I don't know what that facial hair is, and I don't even know what bitches are. <laughs> We're going to do a little something called Clear the Cash! Yes! I seen a super hot chick with an ugly kid. <laughs> yeah. Now, look, it wasn't just like this chick. The reason why I was so happy when I saw it, and I was so happy that she got an ugly kid. <laughs> Was because <laughs> Cause you, you see these bitches, right? And you know they're obviously like a fucking titty dancer, like an OnlyFans bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're made up to the fucking nines with fake titties and all that shit. And when you're in Target. fucking Target. Oh, Target, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't need to dress like that to go to Target unless you got to be on your fucking your fucking camera in a fucking half hour. And she had a kid she was told. You could tell it was her kid, you know what I'm saying? And her kid was ugly as fuck. <laughs> she had about- I don't know. She just had like maybe one of her fucking only fans, like fans, <laughs> paid to fuck her or something, and the rubber broke or some shit. I don't know. Definitely. But she's probably just so used to beauty in her life, and she got stuck with an ugly little fucker. <laughs> and I thought that was pretty goddamn awesome. Oh, shit. One for the fucking ugly fucks. Exactly, man. You got a fight ass mom. I'm just like poor kid, because once he gets a teenager, everybody's gonna want to fuck his mom. <laughs> You know, exactly. And she'll probably be on OnlyFans. I'll, maybe her titties will pop and yeah, that's like that's gotta suck. What? Oh, like having an OnlyFans mom? As a mother, yeah. You can just look at her pussy if you want to look it up. <laughs> you know that's because you picture just, just saying like scroll it, through it, your mom's nettings. If you're in school, like the kids are, they're gonna figure it out at some point. Yeah. But Basically. is the money worth the mental torture you got to go through because your mom's a whore? Well, what do you... Public mean, school? There's a bunch of... What if he goes let's private school? The All right, then privately, you're fucking getting busted out of private school because <laughs> right. your mom's a whore. All that but then what's, what's the trade-up for that if you're a bitch? An ugly fucking kid. Well, what if she adopted him? There's not a chance. Yeah. It was her fucking kid, man. Yeah. You don't whip an adopted oh. kid around like that. Yeah, you're happy to have him. I always just picture, you know, she's probably, I, you know, it's so unfair of me to say that, to say that she was a horrible mom, but how do I know? I don't know. Maybe she's an awesome mom. She's just a whore. Whores can be good moms. Yes, how can. old was the kid around? Like, um, He looked like he was probably like seven-ish. Okay. Seven, eight. But he was fucking ugly. 
And I was, that's I couldn't stop thinking, like, yo, she probably fucked some ugly ass dude. Or maybe she just had so much work done, she's just ugly as fuck. True. And was uh, you, you see them bitches putting the makeup on and those the, things? Yes, I have. Uh, so was that you? Some of that toothless ass bitch? No, that was Clay. No, that's this like right. fucking meth mouth bitch with her face all sunk in, looking all nasty, all wrinkly and fucked up looking, uh -huh. and did the whole fucking process with the makeup and looked like a fucking bitch you'd see at a club that's hot. Yeah. Amazing. I couldn't believe it. Well, I could believe it because bitches know how to do that shit now. Yes, they do, do you, man. <laughs> do you see I that see message? It. Oh, yeah. Look at this one. Aspen Two Dope says, imagine bringing your parents to school day. <laughs> career, career, career day. day. <laughs> career day. Your <laughs> just comes in with his uh, fucking G-string on, starts finger blasting hey, herself. With a camera. For the, like, she's trying to get all the other fucking parents to give her money. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So I saw one of the most amazing things I've ever seen in my life. All right. You know how, like... Fucking roads are under construction and shit. Well, I just legitimately stuttered. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. I wasn't trying to play. I was trying to. Holy shit. I was trying to no sell it, but. The stutter boy. Holy. <laughs> stuttering Stanley. Stuttering Stanley. <laughs> wow. When I was going to the Dow Gardens in Midland, Michigan the other day. Uh -huh. I was by your neck of the woods. Yes. And like a whole fucking side of the freeway was shut down. So all the traffic had shifted to the other side of the freeway. It was amazing. It was so much work being done at one time. I couldn't believe it. I counted them with my hands. Ten fucking steamrollers on that bitch at one time. Yeah. Flattening out the pavement. Ten. They don't bullshit out in Midland, bro. They don't. No, they, they got that chemical money. Was it, exactly. So they're like, we would need you. I couldn't uh, fucking believe it. Ten motherfucking yeah. steamrollers. I never even see one around here when they're fixing these bridges and <laughs> shit. It's just some dude out there with one of those fucking big round things. Like that fucking rock creature from the fucking never ending story. M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M M don't know what that was about. But yeah, 10 motherfucking steamrollers. I was so very proud of that construction crew. I wanted to fucking swing through a fucking fast food place and get them all food and coffee. <laughs> Maybe Timmy Ho's. Was oh. Clio. Nice. Oh. I didn't know you wanted to eat right now. Yeah, of course. I always want to eat right oh, now. Well, I came down here to show you something from my youth. Was it a plate of food? <laughs> <laughs> now remember, my mom left my dad when I turned 18. Yeah. Which means that's when I left the house. Yeah. So, I don't know why <laughs> this is what I had as 18, but it, it's... Oh! Let me see that! It's my pocket phone book. Your pocket phone book. Let me see. That was that was like your little black book. Well, <laughs> I don't even remember this the name This is the best thing ever! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> Fuck! Look at that! <laughs> <laughs> you still got this when you're 18? My oh. mom brought over a couple boxes of things. Oh my yeah. god! There's a hunk with a G-string on with a banana hammock, and he's got a headband, and he's holding a fish. Were you into fishing or something? She's like, his fish. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck food? is Patrick? My grandma's house. Huh? Oh, okay. Who the fuck is Patrick? <laughs> Paul, Paul, and Patrick. <laughs> is this Patrick? <laughs> or is this Paul or Paul? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I need to know. This is fucking awesome, though. Oh, it's Chippendales. <gasps> Is it chipping uh, uh, those <laughs> You go to dick bars all the time. <laughs> wow, that was pretty fucking awesome. Thanks for sharing. <laughs> now, what's up on that plate? <laughs> you can get one upstairs. Ah. All right, yeah. So, 10 mile fucking steamrollers. Wait, I was already past that. Wasn't I? That's not the one where they have. Super hot check with an ugly kid. Yeah, in Target a while back when we were shopping, I seen it. You know. That's about it. I, there's nothing more to have tell. Have you never heard the ugly duckling story? This kid was not, no. This kid was, <laughs> no. But yeah, I know that story. And that, that wasn't his case. Poor kid. He was he was doomed. Okay. <laughs> ugly face his whole life. I mean, yeah. we can't all be lookers like me, Justin, and Manny. See? All right, let's Google Paris Hilton's baby. It's the second day in a row people are saying this baby's got a humongous head. Let's check it out right quick. Holy shit, he does got a big head. He looks like an alien. I mean, it's not that big. Well, yeah, I guess it is. Uh, he may have some sort of cranial facial disorder. Like Mega Man? Me, Mega, Mega Mind? Mega Mind. <laughs> what if he talks like Will Ferrell? That'd be great. And that's like a that's like a spandex hat. <laughs> uh, okay, who gives a fuck? Let's... <laughs> this one is just self-explanatory. 
It said, uh, I am so Midwest, I said oops instead of oops. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Thank you. Woo, with the hot sauce. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Salt, pepper, hot sauce. What more could a man want? Damn, I'm sorry. I got to do this. <laughs> you about to get rushed, bro, like in prison. I know. You guys are giving me the fucking eye. So, anyhow, um, that's the end of Clear the Cash. All right. They got this shit coming out soon. I don't know how legit it is or, or what exactly where it's going to be or anything, but it's called the Florida Man Games. And I know two of the things that they said is going to be like beer belly wrestling and fucking um, and running from the, like a race running from the law, <laughs> like like escaping the law. Do you see it? Well, this, there it is. This right is there a, on the top. This is a whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> what? Told you. Let's check this out. This week, only $10 off. They got tickets for it? They have tickets for it. The artwork is Weaponized all Weaponized right. pool noodle mud duel. <laughs> Evading arrest. Register a team. <laughs> you can register That's your team. That's what I've seen. Uh, category five cash grab. What the fuck? So oh yeah, like, it's like grab. Uh, category five wins as you scramble to catch as much real cash as you can. So oh, it's like, like surviving a, a hurricane. Oh, so you're probably going one of those things like they got a Chuck E. Cheese, the ticket thing. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. But a catalytic converter, two bikes, and a handful of copper pipe for <laughs> this time. Oh shit! Beer belly, Florida sumo. Whoa, nitro from the fucking uh, what you call it? And the, the motherfuckers from the gladiators back in the day. Yeah, original oh, gladiators. Yeah. Oh, both of them are Fuck, from it. Ice is old. Both of them are from the original. <clears throat> oh, oh well, there's more stuff. Well, that's just a nowadays contest. There's more stuff. Yeah, let's see. That's the entertainment. Uh, Florida ma'am pinup. So basically some bitches. Chicken coop bingo. <laughs> oh, wow. 911 fight night. Brawl the badges. Oh, so cops fight. That's pretty cool. All right, let, let's see something. Is this legit? Like, when is this? February 24th at Francis Field, St. Augustine. We need to go. Oh, you can get a selfie and autograph from Nitro and Ice. I don't want for an extra don't 50 bucks. Them. $50? Yep. What do you get a selfie and a autograph? Yep. So I'm going to pull autograph. the same thing that happens in our meet and greets and stuff. I'm going to, like, try to take 14 pictures and I'm going to bring a fucking stack of shit this big for them to sign. <laughs> Fuck everybody behind me. Yeah, you know exactly, I mean? right? Oh, that's like fucking super hillbilly area, Florida. Yeah. Nice. That's where it needs to be. Then good old boys around there. They're fucking out and get murdered. I mean, but we'll vlog it. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. Yeah. When is that? September, February? February 24th. We're going. I want to fucking do this finally. So I'm breaking out with this right quick. Decades of trivia. You're going to read me some trivia questions, and I'm going to fucking answer. Watch how good I am. 1980, Keisha Knight Pullum was the cast of The Cosby Show. Which Huxtable did she play? Um, She was the, uh, um, 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 fuck, I don't know. Was she the, the middle bitch? The one that had that skin condition in real life that she had a talk show for a minute? Nope. No, that's something Bladso, wasn't it? I don't know. Who the fuck was it? She was Rudy. Ah! Oh, I was going to say one of those young bitches. Yeah, when she grew up, Rudy. she was fine. <laughs> yeah, man. Rudy was in T.I.'s video and everything. So, or, or was it Chingy? I can't remember. <laughs> Anyways, check it out. 1990s. This 92 presidential candidate was a... 1992? <laughs> Hold on, yes. I can't even get this out. This 1992 president presidential candidate was a former grand wizard of the KKK. David Duke. And yes. Exactly. I remember that David Duke guy. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah. He tried to run for president, man. Was that he against almost did. that was against Bush? I don't know. Whoever was yeah, I, don't I believe know. so. All right, here we go. Two thousands. This actor cast the spells in the title role on the Harry Potter movies. Daniel Radcliffe. Oh, my God. How'd you know that? I know that fucking kid. Yeah, Are man. Are you being serious? Yeah. I mean, yeah. I didn't know you knew his 
by his. I don't know Harry Potter. He's a famous actor besides Harry Potter. Oh, I don't ever see him. Harry Potter was so fucking big. How do you not know who that kid? I, mean, I didn't know his name either, man. Really? <laughs> no. I knew him as Harry Potter. That's that, about it. That's what I, I knew him as say, Harry Twatter. I was going to say Harry Potter. <laughs> Twatter. A cat named Socks lived at the White House during the this Bill president's term. Damn. He was also fucking children on Epstein Island. Oh, oh wow. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, my God. Here we go. Here's it's, a good one. I'm, He's a children it fucker. It happened. Here we go. This lovely daytime talk host, talk show host, lovely. is a mind. cover girl. Oh, fucking that Naomi bitch? Nope. Uh, fuck. Uh, um, Roseanne? No. <laughs> Ricky Lake? No. I don't know. You, you got a guess, Brutalis? That one bitch, guess. that model bitch, you had a daytime show, no? <laughs> daytime talk show. Jerry I would have never guessed I think I Chad's guess got this it. either. What? Ellen DeGeneres. She's what? a white cover she girl? She's a cover girl. For what? It said. It says this lovely daytime a talk show. A cover girl for what? Is also a cover girl. Yeah, she turned into a real so bitch, for huh? Makeup. Well, she didn't she get canceled because like she was treating all her employees like, like pieces of shit. I think so. And she came out all dancing to shoop all the time, like, <laughs> oh, I'm Ellen. I'm just always oh, so nice and cool. And Lizzo did that. She too. was just a bitch. What? <laughs> yeah, she was. I said Lizzo did that too, but what, came oh, out dancing to shoop. No, it was treating people no, like shit. Treating, oh well, yeah, but like she shit. doesn't. She doesn't have a talk show where her old gimmick is being friendly and silly That's and true. treating people extraordinary well. According to the Spice Girls, if you want to be my lover, you got to do... You got to get with my friends. Make yes. it forever. Friendship never ends. Yes. Oh, shit. If you really, really want, if you really, really want, if you really have, really have, really have. Really, really, really. In 2007, <laughs> lead was found in the drinking water of this Michigan city. Oh, <laughs> plant. I'm right down the street from exactly. that bitch. Exactly. F-L-I-N-T, baby. Right. Oh, shit. Okay. That's, that's really close to home. Uh, in 1992, okay. <laughs> the impress... It's a double oh, I'm sorry. Words. In 1992, to impress young voters, Bill Clinton played the saxophone on this TV Arsenio. show. Yes. I guess so in 1992, uh, that one guy was going up against George Clinton or Bill Clinton. Yeah. Was the, 92, the same shit. Yeah, uh, the, the, Duke's guy. yeah, the fucking KKK guy. Yeah. Okay. KKK guy or kid fucker? Hmm. Who? Who? Oh, shit. Here we go, Justin. Who was Barack Obama's vice president? Fuck. Um, uh, it was it was uh, Joe Biden. Mike Joe Biden. Oh, that one. Mike Joe Biden. Pence. Wrong. No. What would you say, Justin? Joe Biden. Yes. Yes. Who was Mike Pence. Trump. No. He looked like the fucking some other guy. <laughs> I know that name somewhere. Mike yeah. Pence was Trump's oh. vice president. Okay. Cool. There we go. All right. Well, shit. That way. That that went by pretty quick. That was fun. Yeah. That was. Um... We'll see you, Holla Wicked. Fuck it. Yeah!